Hey, it's Mr. Wonderfuck, and welcome back to more Let's Play Psychonauts. In the last episode, we got the Queen of Hearts, and made it to this garden. Yeah. And there's a figment. Yeah. Gardens and figments. Yeah. Saying the word, yeah. Yeah. And this is why I am the most obnoxious person on YouTube. That is not even close to true. Don't even, don't even say that. There are way more people more obnoxious than me. Anyway! Why am I talking about this? I don't know. Let's just continue doing things. Alright, so we got what was there, which was the garden. Uh, my throat still quite hurts. And we're now going to continue on with what we're supposed to be doing, which is finding... We only have one more card, don't we? Or do we? No, I think we have two more, now that I think about it. We have... Let's see, we got hearts and clubs, but I don't think we have spades or... Uh, diamonds. Diamonds, yeah! I know cards. I know cards, kind of. I'm, I'm actually really bad with, like, just playing, playing cards, oddly enough. I mean, I guess that's not that odd, I just... And I like to play poker more. I, I've, I've enjoyed the aspects of poker I've played. Also... Who decided it would be a good idea to let the sensors jump? Who at Double Fine was like, you know what the sensors need to do? Jump. Because you come to this place, and there's a million of them, including these really strong guys that can just kill you in one hit. And the exploding guys, and the melee, well, like the normal melee guys, and the ranged guys, and it's just... It's insane! See, here I'm trying to fight this big guy while hearing eh, in the background and then having to dodge that guy's spit attacks. And I just like bounced on his head. Hey, buddy, stop it. Alright. Also, great, now I... Okay. <laughs> I was hearing a that stupid heartbeat sound that's supposed to say, you know, you're low on health. And it was kind of annoying. Okay, so we're not going to go over there yet. Would it be a good idea to do this first? I don't know. We're going to do this first. I don't know if this is a good idea to do first, but we're going to do it first. Uh, first off, over here is the hat box tag. And over here, if we use the window painting, we can create... You'll never guess this. A window. I know. That's amazing. A window. Which brings us to here. The other side of the window, presumably. And here we get maximum project that. Yay! Which increases health? I don't know. I'm going to say it increases health. But uh, that actually brings us up here, which... Oh, you know what? Actually, this is... Okay, wow. That's a This is actually the place we need to be much later in the level, which means the window is, in fact, required. Man, that sucks, and you have to pay for it? That's... lame. <laughs> okay, uh, that's alright, though. Oh my god! Let's run away! <laughs> what was that? Uh, three bunches of bananas right here, though. Um, I've noticed a lot of the figments in this area are all, like, really packed together. Then again, I guess this whole level is kind of like that. It's a very condensed level. Also, I see you, Queen of Diamonds. Introducing, back from a crushing victory at someone might lose a tooth in Duluth, Eagle! Kaka! <laughs> That's it. Kaka. Kaka. Yeah, none of those. None of those subtitles were anything at all what they said. That's okay. Oh. <clears throat> God, boy, stop it. Alright, so this guy, uh, actually, is probably one of the easier ones. Um, when he jumps into the air, you can see a shadow on the ground. You just have to use your, uh, your levitation ball and get away. It's, it's not that difficult. Um, also, I can still hear that annoying heartbeat sound, even though these fights don't use the regular HP bar. It's kind of irritating. 
to say the least. Now I have like this very subtle heartbeat sound. You probably can't hear it uh, just watching the video, but through these headphones it's very prominent and it's very irritating. Uh, just as it's irritating, the fact that he can keep getting combos on me, but I can't get a combo on him. But that's a... I was not anywhere near your shadow, you fat symbol of the American people. <laughs> Freedom! Alright. Uh, no. No America jokes here. I'm sick of America jokes. So let's just go ahead and dodge Mr. Eagle Man. Cuckoo! Alright, yeah, there we go. There I was nowhere close to you. All right, let's see if we yeah, let's see if we can do like a couple those big attacks where you like keep hitting it as you fall down. Yeah. That's a good way to do it. That is a great way to do it. That does a lot of damage actually. All right. I guess I can still talk during this cutscene cuz it's not like really anything important happens. Uh that was a really bad way to order the words in that sentence. Wow. I can still hear the heartbeat. That is going to drive me insane. Man. Okay. So I have to say this brain is going very successfully so far. I was not expecting to do well whatsoever. Um, I was expecting like rage and stuff. So sorry if you're disappointed that I'm not raging or anything. Anyway, this go ahead and give him the card. Pain in the butt to get. You already said that. Perfect. One step closer. This cutscene is exactly the same. I have, have these all been the same? I haven't been paying attention. I don't know. Maybe we'll find out on the fourth one because we only have one more card Please, to get. Boy, I must have those which is the. Let's see, we have Queen's Hearts. Spades! Spades is what we're going for, right? I believe so. Uh, where is. Diamonds. Diamonds! Also, I need that health, actually. There we go. Heartbeat went away. I can't hear my heartbeat anymore. Oh, that sound clip. <laughs> oh, jeez. Alright, that's alright. That's only like the fifth time we've heard it. Alright, so, I need to stop saying alright. I don't even really say alright, it's more like alright. Aight. <laughs> no, none of that. Okay. Uh, can we get anything down there, or is it a lost cause? I'm guessing it's a lost cause, but I'm checking anyway. Yeah, just what I thought. There's no way to, uh, there's nowhere to go to be safe. Well, anyway. Alright, so now we have to actually go through the window, and that will bring us to actually pretty close to the end of the stage, I'll be honest. Um, it's pretty, pretty surprising that we're almost at the end of the brain. Um, in that failed recording session I was telling you about... <laughs> By this time, by like three or f like three videos in, I was I don't even think I had beaten um, the diamonds queen wrestler guy whatever. Okay, so we do see. You know what? Yeah, let's do this first. Okay, queen of spades. Let's do this first. First and foremost. But wait, actually, I just remembered this thing. Uh, you can't actually beat this one yet. Um. I guess I could have let you see that just by doing it, but no, we can't actually beat it without going in here first. I just remember that. So, yeah, let's go in here, naturally. Let's get this, and this, and just all the figments in the world. Every single figment on Earth shall be ours to collect. Also, I see that tag over here for the suitcase. Alright, is that all the figments? Hopefully. Well, there's a fire one over here. And then, if we go through here, we have this weird, like, secret area. I don't know what's up with this. Another cobweb. This is the this is the one at the beginning. Yeah, this is the one at the beginning of the stage. See, I knew how to get it. And also, there's the... whatever that was. Was that the suitcase? I don't even know. Uh, how much... Okay, we still have the hat box. And I know where the hat box is! We are making good... Good progress. Great progress, even. Yeah. Alright. Let's go ahead get up these really awkwardly designed stairs, actually. They can't just walk up. I don't know what's up with that. And go in here, and we see this guy. Also, hat box. Bam. 
there is all of the emotional baggage. Which gives us the primal memories! Let's go ahead and see that. Because apparently that's the tradition, is we always see the primal memories when we... Uh, un unlock it. Words. Anyway. Let's see what concept art we have. We have this guy. Was his name Crispin? I don't know. Uh, but uh, the uh, the orderly at the asylum, as well as Edgar Tegli, Teg Tigli, Teg Tingly. I don't know. And the dog, and the fountain, and the thing, and the that guy, and that chick, and that thing. And okay, that was fun. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. Uh, you must be the towel boy. You want an autograph? I don't just hand those out. And that's a good lesson for you. Anticipate disappointment. Take me. I'm the greatest bullfighter who's ever lived. Yet my upcoming match against the town bull has received virtually no marketing support. A towering advertisement is supposed to have been painted just outside my window. But as you can see, the job hasn't even been started. I think that bull is trampling anyone who tries to paint on the wall. Maybe you could stop it. So instead of challenging the bull before a stadium packed with screaming women, you want me to fight it on the street in front of one dog and one child wearing a crude towel boy disguise. That's a terrible idea. Here's a better one. You go get that billboard painted and I'll reward you handsomely, which is how I do it. As an advance, I'll give you one of my secret weapons. Use it if anyone can stop. What an a-hole! Wow! Okay, so that actually gives us the last power, one that I'm actually not really a fan, <coughs> a fan of. So if you remember in the I think I think it was the very first boss fight with the uh, with the tank the think tank <laughs> uh, it you it lobbed like these green grenades which confused us well now we have that power which is exciting I suppose uh, and we can actually go ahead and use it on the bowl to make the bowl confuse and make it stop in its tracks all right and that's what we're gonna have to use to go get that billboard painted as we will see here in a minute. I want to see how many figments I have. I am missing 11. Okay, that might be kind of annoying to go find them. But, I don't know, maybe I'll see them easily? Maybe, I don't know. I guess we'll see. Let's go get that billboard painted for Mr. Jerkwad. Hey, uh, we really gotta get that billboard painted. Okay, man, here's the plan. Step one, I quit we. Step two, we, which is now just you runs out there and gets killed painting the building. Maybe I can distract the bull while you paint. It's so crazy, it just might work. Or maybe it's so crazy that it's just extra crazy. There's absolutely no way I'm going out there. Come on, you're a bulldog. Show some backbone. Plus, who wants to go for a walk? Who wants to go for a walk? Stupid dog. Brain. Uh. Say go boy, get moving. Alright, so all we have to do is toss a grenade, and when he hits the fumes, poof! Actually, is he in the way? I don't go know, let's boy. find out. Go! Hopefully he's not in the way. He's not! Okay, cool. Excellent. Hurry up. Hurry up. Figment, 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 figment! Okay, fine. 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 We'll continue watching him paint. Are you done yet? Yeah, you're done. Yeah. Excellent. Mm. Good boy. It's not great, but I suppose it's just barely good enough. Come see me if you still want your reward. You know, your advice didn't work. Really? Then here's some new advice. I don't know what you're talking about. How about that reward? Fine then. One autograph. You know, my bulldog Frank could still paint a beer gun on that poster out there. All right, here, take this. But I warn you, I won't be able to sign it. All right, so that is actually an optional thing. You don't have to do it, but it gives you that, um, which is indeed missable. If you complete this without doing that first, then you can't get it. 
So, we're definitely coming up on time, but I think I want to go ahead and go get all the figments before we continue on. And then next episode will actually uh, be the final one of this brain. So let's go ahead and confuse the bowl because, I don't know, because uh, it's easier. And, okay, so there's a figment. Oh, God, I don't know where the other ones are. Where'd it go? I actually have no idea where it went because it went in the wall. I don't know what its path is. Let's see what's down here. Oh, it's just another portal. Okay. Uh, where did that figment go? I want <laughs> the figment! Figment, 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 fig. Okay, it's probably coming through here. Figment, figment, figment! Why is. <sighs> and now it's going through that window. I went. Hey, that's the window we went through when we went through the window. Huh. How about that? That was possibly one of the dumbest things I've ever said. Okay, I'd really rather like to get it, though. If at all possible. Let's see if we can get it in here. <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna cut till I get it. Why am I even showing this? There we go. That was an annoying figment, to be perfectly honest. Okay, let's see. Okay, so here by the Queen of Hearts, if you take... Oh, thank God. I thought I didn't have the window painting. Alright, so you take the window painting. Um, I don't know how you're supposed to figure this out by yourself. I didn't know how to figure it out, but uh, yeah, if you do that, you get a figment. A single figment. Yeah. Okay, so... It would seem that pretty much anywhere you can hang a painting um, and you hang the window gives you a figment so yeah there's that uh, so that's that's good to know oh hey look at that look at that uh, that's one I even saw and then I just blatantly missed uh, this is by the Queen of what is that the Queen of Diamonds down there uh, totally forgot this was over here and actually over here Another two figments. Wow. Okay. Sadly, I missed those. Okay. <laughs> well, there we go. We got them. Oh! Alright, so this is uh, the apartment area by the Queen of Hearts portal. Um, but anyway, if you get up here and actually use this awning and come over... And come over here, we get those figments and I'm apparently still missing two all right okay so actually in the apartment I somehow missed this this tiny frickin candle and also I am now gliding on midair yeah huh so if you use confusion grenades on enemies, they attack each other. Sweet. Okay, so... At last... Look at that tiny freaking figment. Look at how difficult that is to spot. That is the last figment. Pretty sure that that was the last figment. The first time I played. Oh, that was horrible. So, uh, after way too long, it's seriously been like 40 minutes, um, I'm finally going to end this episode, and then, next time on Let's Play Psychonauts, we're going to complete Black Velvetopia. So, until then, I hope you enjoyed watching, and oh my god, I'm so getting out of here, and I shall see you next time.